Nagatoro has caused a lot of controversy on the internet. Some of it warranted, most of it not, but I really think that's a testament to how this show can get people to ask the questions that really matter, the ones that we need to be asking about modern day anime, how it can be improved, where things have gone wrong, and where we should go in the future. So today I figured it's about time we finally answered the question that's been on everybody's mind since the start of this whole thing, which is of course whether or not Nagatoro should say the n-word. Now before in the past, I've covered whether other anime girls could say the n-word, but this one is a should, not a could debate. So we're going to come at this from an in-universe perspective, as well as looking at the real-world implications. To begin, let's take a scenario where Nagatoro is in her classroom, and she then proceeds to say the n-word in front of everyone there. This is not an ideal situation to be in or to witness, but when considering the fact that Nagatoro is Japanese, she likely wouldn't face many consequences for having done so. Certainly, she'd get in trouble for disrupting class, but further social consequences beyond that simply wouldn't happen. You've got to consider here that Japan is a country where English is not the first language. Likely very few people in the room would speak sufficient English to understand what was said. The n-word is not going to be taught in a Japanese English learning class, and the extreme weight due to its historical significance in American and European cultures would be lost on them. And I'm not even really theorizing here at all. With how many clips there are VTubers accidentally saying the n-word and not even realizing that anything happened, it's pretty clear that this is just how it is. Which makes sense, you can't really expect every single person in the world to understand the hard-hitting significance of a word that isn't in their native language and really has no relevance in their culture. But with all that being said, just because she wouldn't face any consequences for doing so is not really a reason for her to say it in the first place. It's likely that Nagatora wouldn't even know of the word's existence, so it wouldn't make sense from a lore perspective. Throughout the story, Nagatoro hasn't shown much animosity towards people of other races, so I can't see why she would say it there. No matter how you look at it, Nagatoro doesn't have anything to gain from saying the n-word. Granted, she also doesn't have much to lose in doing so, but honestly, the only reason why I can find that anyone would even want her to say it in the first place is if they were projecting their own desire to say it onto her. Alright, now let's break the fourth wall a little bit and let's examine this from the writer's perspective. So, should the writer have included a scene where Nagatoro says the n-word? The answer is easily no. It is completely unnecessary for the telling of the story, and frankly, it just doesn't fit in with the type of show that Nagatoro is. Its use would only really be justified if Nagatoro saying the word would somehow enhance the emotional impact of a scene, if it improves the historical accuracy, or if using it somehow improves the message that the author is trying to portray. It's for reasons like these that the use of the n-word makes sense in, say, a movie about the brutal racism of the Jim Crow era, or a game about 90s street gangs, but doesn't make much sense in the context of Nagatoro. So, in conclusion, no matter how we look at it, whether it's from an in-universe perspective or from a writing perspective, Nagatoro should not say the n-word.